When Naruto arrives, he tells Sasuke it's impossible to do everything alone like he plans to, pointing to the missteps Itachi made and their own successful teamwork against Kaguya. Sasuke replies that he only wants to make a better world, one where he can be solely responsible for the difficult decisions that must be made so that nobody else needs to. Enraged, Naruto states Sasuke is still going against what Itachi wanted for him, and they start fighting. As they near exhaustion, Sasuke uses Chidori and Naruto counters with Rasengan, the collision of which knocks them both out. Sasuke wakes up and finds that he and Naruto each lost an arm and that neither of them could move. Sasuke asks Naruto why he never gives up on him. Naruto answers that he experiences pain whenever Sasuke is going through a tough time. Sasuke finally admits defeat as he's come to accept that Naruto is just as vital to him as he is to Naruto. Sakura and Kakashi arrive and Sakura begins healing them. Sasuke apologizes to Sakura for everything he's done, which she tearfully accepts. After Sasuke frees all nine-tailed beasts, Sasuke and Naruto undo the infinite Tsukuyomi, saving the world.